A woman who left the United States to join ISIS is now vowing to turn her back on the terrorist organization. Huda Matana, family, her family filed a lawsuit fighting to allow her and her young child back into the country. WVTM 13's Chip Scarborough shares her hopes and why some in Hoover hope she doesn't return. I definitely will condemn ISIS. Huda Mutana just wants to come home. I can easily say I've done nothing for the past four years <laughs> except stay in my house, cook and clean. Right now, the Hoover woman is in a Syrian refugee camp, but Hoover City Councilman John Lida says she's not welcome. And I believe, in fact, I know that it's where the vast majority of the residents of Hoover stand as well. Mutana's father is suing the Trump administration, which says she is not a U.S. citizen and can't return. Lida supports the president's decision, but also sees the other side. Her parents are doing exactly what any parent would do. In fact, my wife and I would do the exact same thing. They're fighting uh, as much as they can to bring their girl home from a situation uh, where her life may be in danger. But Lida says Mutana made the decision to join ISIS and must deal with the consequences. If in fact her 18-month-old son is now caught in the middle of a, a scenario that the world is watching. Mutana says her son is the only thing she doesn't regret. And if I can erase everything and have my son in America, I would have preferred that really. An attorney for Mutana's father says the lawsuit is not about protecting her from the criminal justice system, but instead recognizing her U.S. citizenship and her son's. In Hoover, Chip Scarborough, WVTM 13. A former day